My, hey everybody, my name is Eric Gales. I'm the lead guitarist and founder of uh, Eric Gales, Team EG. And uh, we do blues rock with a little blend of everything else tossed in there. And uh, we just, uh, we are definitely a high energy, high emotion and high uh, passion driven band. And uh, we love it. Don't love me. I know, no, no. Somebody that will. I came on really. Honestly, the middle of the road uh, title come from being. It, it, my father says it to me all the time in life. If you're in the middle of the road, you're in the best vantage point of driving. That way, you're not in the median. You're not in the gravel. You're in the precise spot that you can see everything and have a handle on everything. So that was my interpretation of middle of the road. You disrespect me right in my face. Well, simple in here, yeah. Fortunately, but unfortunately, some of the hardest times and saddest times in life, I basically call it pain bring some of the deepest music and I often say that uh, you know the average public are the beneficiaries of our pain you know and uh, so am I because it feels good after playing it you know what I mean it's uh, but you know going through the pain ain't so good but when you know I uh, often have thoughts of people that don't have an outlet to be able to play about their pain you know what I mean they just have to deal with it you know what I mean yeah so having the opportunity to play about it and, and, and release it some kind of way, that's, I think that's an awesome thing. Don't love me I don't know no That somebody at Moulin Blues Festival will Well, I can tell you, the question is, do I consider myself a rebellious person? Um, Maybe you can ask my wife that question. No, but anyway, uh, for a long time I was, man. I, I rebelled and, uh, you know, it was just for no reason. I mean, it was against myself uh, to be to try to explain it the best way I can. But, you know, not long ago uh, I came with a, a, new, a, new, a new set of uh, eyes that I was looking through things and uh, it began to, you know, kind of come back around to the right way that things are supposed to be and uh, you know I'm not so rebellious now. The burden was things that I was allowing myself to get into that really wasn't the right things, you know. And fortunately, the things that I went through, it I didn't die from it, you know, because I toyed with debt for like 20 plus years. And uh, yeah, truthfully, I mean, I even speak about it in the show. So uh, honestly, that's part of the show that you should really make sure you get a part of. I tell my whole story in the beginning of the show. But, uh, you know, now I'm almost two years clean and uh, life is really good. I know my wife is really ecstatic that I have finally cleaned up and everything. And so, you know, it's all <laughs> as she gives the thumbs up in the background there. But, uh, you know, it's uh, it's going great, man. Life is really awesome. Man. Man, something clicked, man. You know, I got to say it's, it's a positive influence of my wife that had been telling me for years, you know, and we almost been married. We've been married almost six years. And in the first four years, she got took through a roller coaster. Honestly, she did. And uh, she would always say, you know, you got something, something is missing in you, you know, and I don't know what it is, but, and she tried to figure it out for years. And, you know, until I just came and said, man, you know, I got, I got issues. I got problems, you know, with substance. and. And, and just the whole whole lifestyle that came along with drugs and alcohol and stuff like that. And, you know, I just finally let it go. And I don't know what I was fighting against the whole time, you know? I don't know why was I fighting against trying to, you know, be free. And uh, I finally got free, man. I did. And it's an awesome feeling. <laughs>
the message to the world is, uh, you know, I was missing for a while, but I'm back and watch out, basically. Hey everybody, my name is Eric Gales and I'm here at the Mulan Blues Festival, man. And uh, you're listening to theBluesRadio.com. It's awesome. Tune in. If you ain't, shame on you. Boom. <laughs>